you can now automatically activate Blue Sky monitoring for your patients at the end of the Blue Sky plan aligner flow. The data is transferred automatically and your first five Blue Sky monitoring patients are completely free. Each additional patient is just a one-time cost of $29 per patient with no monthly subscription fees and the scope can be ordered online or printed out locally. We're gonna start the process by selecting orthodontics aligners. Create a new patient for your liner case. We're going to call our patient Sky Blue, and we're going to enter an email and phone number. At this point for this flow, entering an email and phone is important as for Blue Sky monitoring is going to be sending reminders and notifications to the patient with these details. Okay, so I've entered the details and I'm going to click create. If this patient previously existed in your system, then simply click the edit button and add the relevant email and phone number for the patient. Okay, I have my patient Blue Sky with the email on the phone. Our treatment is created automatically. We could edit it if we like. Both draw selection and click next to start the process. I'm going to run quickly through the line of flow just for demonstration purposes, but we're not going to be focusing on the liner functionality in this video. I've selected two files, my upper and lower arches, and now I'm going to click OK. Next, continue on Blue Sky Plan, and the software is going to run through the automatic data preparation steps completely automatically. And now we're ready for the digital tooth setup. We're going to have the software automatically propose the digital tooth setup, align both jaws automatically. And now, of course, the user should review and confirm the setup. But for the demonstration purposes for this video, we're going to take this and click continue to edit steps. The software has set up the teeth movement for the various steps, and we're going to click continue to export and report generation. Okay, so we've gotten to the export stage. We have the export models checkbox checked as usual. We're going to click export both jaws. We want to create the reports. And here is the checkbox to activate remote monitoring for this patient. So we're going to select this checkbox as well. Now I'm going to click the export button. The software reminds us to add the base for vertical printing and to label the models as necessary. I'm going to click yes, proceed to export. Let's create a folder on our desktop for the export. New folder, sky blue liner data files. Now all the models, the case information and the reports and everything are going to be saved to this folder. The software is creating the various models and performing the export. So the models and the data files have been exported and saved to a computer. The software now automatically opens a dialog box window to start the monitoring process. We have a three step setup process as usual, most of the data is automatically populated. So you could review the patient's name, you can modify as necessary, but it's a good idea to keep the same data that was entered at the beginning of the process flow is being auto-populated here. So keep the data the way it is. Confirm accurate email and phone number, and then go ahead and click on next. Now we have the treatment information. So once again, all the population for almost everything. The treatment name is Blue Sky, the patient's name with the word aligners. It's an orthodontic aligner case. 
and the first liner start is automatically populated with today's date. If you know the patient's coming in in a week to get their liners, you could change it. You'll be able to change it later in the flow as well. So there's nothing to worry about. You can enter any description and treatment status for the monitoring is new, so just keep that the way it is. We have various checkboxes here. Ask for fit rating on a liner change. If you like the, the patient to be prompted to say how the aligner is fitting, if it's tight, if it's loose, when they're changing their liners, then go ahead and check this box. Immediate trial, patient education scan and fit rating. This is going to ask for an immediate scan as soon as you finish this process. It's a good idea if the patient's in your office and you could do the first scans with them to go through the process with them so they could become familiar with the process flow. So we have this checked by default and we have the box required dentist approval before a liner change. So if you would like to get the scans and then only decide to approve the patient's aligner change, then check the checkbox and the patient will be prompted to change their liners only after your approval. Now the relevant data files for the 3D view is automatically attached that's being transferred over from Blue Sky Plan automatically. The number of aligner steps is populated automatically and the liner change frequency, again, is populated automatically. Just review and confirm. Go ahead and click on next. Now we're at the third and final step of scheduling scan requests and defining what type of scans the patient should be doing. So the scan request we have set by default on the day of the liner change before they change their aligner and it's every second the liner change. It's not every time they change their liners. The prompt currently is for every second time they change their liners. And again, you could always modify all of these fields if necessary. So that's the frequency schedule of when they're going to be requested to perform a scan. Now, what type of scan they're going to be doing. So we have that auto populated as well. Each time they're requested, we're going to be asking for two scans. One is a video scan horizontal from side to side with their mouth closed wearing their current aligners. The second scan that we have is again a video scan side to side with their mouth closed but the patients can be prompted to switch their aligners before performing the second scan. So we have with next aligners. So these are the default options the patient's going to scan once with their current aligners and once with their next aligners and you'll be receiving those scans for review. Once you've confirmed or modified as necessary, go ahead and click on finish. All the data files are now being uploaded from the computer to the Blue Sky monitoring system. You're going to have a 3D view of the treatment plan for each liner step showing up on one side of the screen, and you're going to have the video scans for each step on the other side of the screen. So for the relevant step, you're gonna have a side-by-side -side comparison between the digital treatment plan for that aligner step and the scans for the patient for that aligner step. So it's important to keep this window open until the upload is complete. You'll receive notification on screen once the files have all been uploaded successfully, and then you'll see the patient in the Blue Sky Monitoring platform. Okay, we have now received confirmation that the patient has been activated successfully in Blue Sky Monitoring with the button, go to Blue Sky Monitoring now. So let's go ahead and click that button. And once we go ahead and log into Blue Sky Monitoring, we could see our new patient. And if we have additional patients, they'll show up in a list here. And we could see the schedule that was created for the patient. Now this schedule includes the liner changes, the scan requests, everything is broken down by week. It shows which aligner the patient is up to, when the next aligner changes, the frequency of the change, and all the relevant data connected to the patient's schedule appears here. Of course, the patient will be receiving reminders and prompts as to when to change their aligner, when to do the scans, and of course, exactly a step-by-step -step process to take them through the scanning process. We could also see information regarding to this patient's Blue Sky aligners treatment. If we go ahead and click here, for example, we could see all the data information that was transferred from Blue Sky Plan. 
Okay, we could see the treatment plan here from Blue Sky Plan, step by step. And once you have, and once scans come in from the patient, you'll have a side-by-side -side comparison between the digital plan on the left side of the screen and the scans from the patient on the right side of the screen.